Hendricks has you boxed in. Look, there's nothing I can do about the lockdown from out here. But I promised I'd help you. So listen. Deep storage was built with a series of data vault modules that can be jettisoned from the station. It's a redundant backup system. That's your way out. Look at my workstation again. I'm exposing a utility that'll open up one of the vaults. Once you're in, look for a manual release. Then your ass is space junk, like me. And if you manage to get back inside, remember, you owe me. Kill the son of a bitch who hurt Abby, or I swear to God I'll haunt you.
are sealed, but there's a, an opening at the cargo bay you could use. I think you can get back inside the station here. inside this container, but I have no way to dock with the station from in here. I see you, Morgan. We've locked down the cargo bay. We're safe for the moment. It will be a trick to get inside. There's not an airlock anymore. That explosion took care of that. Maybe you can do something with the shipping containers. would be my coffin. Even the stale air of Talos laced with a faint hint of nicotine and antibacterians. Oh, it's like spring. You are my thanks, Dr. Yu. But I thought... Well, you're no longer running the memory hamster wheel, I see. I hope you're coming in after me. Would be good to see a familiar face. I'm transmitting the code to the crate I was in. I found Dr. Igwe. He worked in the simulation lab and in psychotronics. He might be helpful, but he's unlikely to approve of your mission, despite everything he's suffered. Though, I will note, he's always admired you and Alex quite a bit. Hey, uh, Jessica, got a minute? It's my day off. Yeah, but... Can you run me through the container docking procedure again? I 
I missed the training session. Ugh, Grant. Please, if I ask Gus again, he'll lose his mind. Are you at the crate docking control station? Yes. First, enter the handling number on the container you want to dock. Um, where do I get the number? Look at the container, Grant. It's stenciled on the outside. Once you enter the number, you should see some options pop up. Select dock. That's it. The container just docks itself, right? Yes, Grant. It docks itself. They are all self-piloting. And I guess open opens the container? Yes. But both ends can never be open at the same time. That way, the interior loading zone stays pressurized even when the cargo bay doors are open. Okay. I think I got it. Thanks, Jess. Jess? Hey, you there? Okay, bye. Doctor Yu! Morgan! Up here! Officer Cool! If we can't open the main door or our friends are gonna pour through, 
Get up to the catwalk. We'll get you inside. To you again i want to thank you for the timely rescue i hope you recall me dr igwe dio igwe your brother alex brought me to the station to head up neuromod research i have one but no aptitude template We're saving it but well now might be best here i'm sure you could make better use of it microgravity upsets my equilibrium I need to steady myself after the slow roll of the crate. Oh, I could feel it, turning, you know? My stomach along with it. Closest I've ever come to vertigo. And claustrophobia. Must be a neuromod that could cure that. Morgan? I thought... I don't know what I thought. It's good to see you. Is Transtar mounting a rescue operation? I was in fuel storage when, when the fire broke out and everyone began running. But they weren't running from the fire, it was these shapes. I had contained the fire and I was trying to reach the power supply when Al, Officer Rose, came and got me out. I'm glad he did. I didn't know what was going on or anything about those things. Everyone I worked with, they're dead, aren't they? I wonder if one of the creatures caused the explosion in fuel storage. Are they intelligent? Did they plan this? I heard all the escape pods malfunctioned. All of them. How is that possible? If only I had reached the power supply in time. God, watching those things move makes me sick. What is it doing? Oh my God, did it? I think I'm gonna be sick. It just made another one of those things, like it, like it pulled it right out of Enoch's corpse. 
Ugh, corpse, maybe. I don't know, maybe it saved him. It could still be Enoch. Does it look like it? Sam, promise me you'll kill me if I ever end up like that. Sarah will get us out of this. She got us this far. We're safe in here. For now, I'm going to check the perimeter. Obstruction detected. Please clear aperture of debris. If you find a way yes. out of here, Is take Dr. Igwe with you. I wanted Maybe to speak to you about the most help. recent VIP Elsewhere. visit. Leitner, the pianist. Chief, if there were any problems, I checked the schedule, the roster. I did my best to make sure Igwe wasn't too... Igwe. Chief, I even had Leitner's cigarettes waiting. You did an excellent job. In fact, Leitner praised you specifically. There'll be a bonus for you in your next pay cycle. Take Nicole out for a nice dinner, all right? Yes, Chief. Thank you, Chief. No. Igwe figures he'd survive. So you came all this way only to get back into Talos? Only way in is through the door to Cargo Bay B, which is filled with those creatures that your brother insisted couldn't escape confinement. Kind of like you. I'm the only one with the code. It's yours if you can help us secure the firepower we should have had when assigned here. The Eradicator Turret Fabrication Plan. The... Wait. You have the Fabrication Plan already. That means all we need is a working Fabricator. But there was an accident in fuel storage, so power's down. We'd need to get the power back on. I couldn't ask you to risk yourself. The explosion in fuel storage nearly killed Ekaterina. I can't ask anyone to risk themselves. Not even you. Still, look around. Maybe there's some angle you see we don't. You've been resourceful so far. Look, I don't know what you're planning, Morgan, but just remember, the only thing that matters is how you treat the people that are still alive. We're not going anywhere, but that doesn't mean we don't have places to be. We need those turrets. Don't know if Wiggy... Uh, Dr. Igwe is lucky to be here or not. Must be a way to get him safer in his crate. Crate outside the ship. If he stayed there, he might have survived longer than any of us. Officer Hayashi, Dr. Yu. Dr. Igwe is blessed. It was fortunate you came up. Just the same. It means, uh, are you doing okay? Oh, Any luck with the Eradicators? Yeah. Would be a lot better than these cap guns Transtar assigned us. These Transtar PPN-8 pistols are mostly for show. They don't do much against the attackers. With the Eradicator turrets, we have a chance. Doctor Yu, were you up in crew quarters? Have you seen any sign of my wife, Nicole? Last I heard from her, she was on her way there. If you find her, can you help get her here? The thought that she may have become one of those creatures, it... 
I'm sorry, Doctor Yu. That was out of line. Forgive me. No movement. Room secure. Nothing will get past me. So long since I've seen you. Yeah, it feels like years. Oh, please don't have a chance. Where do you suppose they came from? Psionics. It's all true, isn't it? What these aliens can do, what we can do. To think it was considered chicanery, flimplam, pseudoscience.
Power circuit checks out, and fabricators online. You did it. We're not done with you yet. So get back here safe, all right? No turrets, no code. It's for our safety, and yours. Remember, it's the Eradicator Fabrication Plan we want, not the Reployer Plan. Whatever the hell a Reployer is. the first line of defense against unsanctioned materials entering Talos 1. Report. PPN-8s might as well be water pistols for all the good they do. Have you seen that... golden stuff they make? It's beautiful, but... fills me with dread. Anyway, Chief Elisar's waiting on you.
No turrets, no code. It's for our safety and yours. You restored the power. I don't know how you did it, but... The way they just consumed Enoch made him one of them. Is that what they want? I wish I could have been more help. I tried to restore the power, but the fire was too much. Before Al, Officer Rose pulled me out of there. EATs are online and primed. Can't wait until our friends get a taste of these. Here's the code for Cargo Bay B. Before sliding the door open, check your surroundings. Take a mental snapshot. You start seeing double of anything, be sure you know which target to shoot. We're gonna pop Officer the door ready. Nothing is worth this shit. What's next? I'm pumped! Is this a joke? Morgan, you saved our asses. Now, you might want to get out there and see if you can save a few more.
Micah, not sure you got your transcribe. Morgan is making her way to you now. Warning you and anyone else, so you don't shoot her accidentally. Or... on her. Jonathan? Shoot <laughs> Morgan? Mikhaila, get in Vic to check your transcribe. Got <coughs> you. I thought you left because... Never mind. Airlocks and lifts are locked up. Like my lungs. Paraplexes. I'm even seeing the spots now. You were right. <coughs> even if I could get my booster shots from my office. But I think I can get us out. <coughs> By cycling the main reactor to bypass the lock bomb. I know it sounds crazy, but... I can you through it. I do it myself, but... Well, just get here, alright? 